Well, hello everybody, Robin Jones, Chair of Roma, and I'm here to update you on our April board meeting. So if you recall at the Roma conference, Minister Thompson, uh, Agriculture, Food and Rural Affairs, launched an initiative to create a new rural economic development strategy. And she actually had her staff there in rooms that if you wanted uh, to take advantage of the consultation, you could do it right there and then. Well, the government is still interested in hearing from you, and I really encourage you to have your say. Uh, so in order to do that, you need to go on to the Ontario.ca website, and your search is Consultation Rural Economic Development Strategy. It's, it's intuitive. Just plug in what you think you need to land, and you will land there. Also at our meeting, I really want to thank the um, AMO policy staff. They truly are some of the smartest people on the face of the earth. And they updated us on several important issues. And one of them was broadband. We know that it is top of mind for everybody that uh, the year 2025 is fast approaching. And you will also recall the work that Roma did, particularly through former president Alan Thompson, former mayor of Caledon. Um, the, the role that, that Roma and Allen played in securing the um, broadband investment in 2021 that promised to bring broadband to all Ontario residents. So AMO policy is really monitoring, and if there appears to be anything that municipalities need to do to move things along, they will certainly uh, share that with us and, and be in touch. So we thank them for watching over that on our behalf. We also received an update uh, on the work that the AMO uh, task force is doing in relation to homelessness, mental health and addictions. And we were briefed on the progress with the social and economic prosperity review that AMO um, is strongly recommending to the government. Now that's another area where we've asked for your support. Uh, if you can go on the AMO website under um, the social and economic prosperity review, review if your council hasn't already, considered passing a resolution, we encourage you to consider it. They really are important in uh, getting this traction for this important review with the government. During the board meeting, uh, the Roma board voted to endorse the call by Ontario Good Roads Association to establish a five-year rural road safety initiative. And we're happy to be uh, adding our, our voice to that. I also wanna share that Roma has received 20 or 25 council resolutions requesting that the Roma and the Good Roads conferences be held together again. So just to back it up a little bit, in 2016, the two associations separated and Roma held its first independent conference in 2017. We also held them during the pandemic. Although virtual, they were still very well attended. So in 2017, there were 800 people who attended in 2024, January of this year, uh, in our eighth conference, 2,000 people attended. So we think we are getting it almost right as it relates to the speakers and the panels. Uh, the Roma board met with the OGRA board in 2019 and considered this question and uh, took the decision not to have our conferences together. And we considered it again last week and by unanimous vote, uh, we are going to ma maintain the status quo. So whether it's good roads, the province, the federal government of Ontario, or the federal government or Ontario's municipalities, regardless of the size, the type or the tier, to succeed and for our province to thrive, we need to work together and advocate on shared priorities. And with that in mind, Roma is very proud to provide funding to support conferences by the Ontario Small Urban Municipalities, OSUM, the Northwestern Ontario Municipal Association, NOMA, and the Federation of Northern Ontario Municipalities, FNAM. And we wish them all the best in their conferences. conferences. Regional conferences are so important, giving opportunity to people to come together and share their ideas. So that's it for now. Stay safe out there, everyone.